Hello there Aquarius, thank you so much for stopping by for your weekly tarot video forecast. This forecast is going to be for the week of December 16th through the 22nd. I do offer personal readings either via phone or Skype should any of these cards bring up questions that you might like to look more deeply into or in case you have some things in your life that are not related to the cards that you would like more clarity on. Either way, I would be honored to be your reader. I do try to get readings done quickly. Once you contact me, I can usually read for you the same day or if not the same day, then the day after we've got a bridge card there we're going to work it that way had a card just fall out um, best way to get a hold of me is to use the contact information on the website listed at the bottom of the screen you guys just have bonus cards coming out today <laughs> Aquarius I had two extra cards come out for you guys so interesting not quite sure how to read this one Whew. all right we're going to look at Monday and Tuesday and then we're going to look at the bridge card between Monday and Tuesday. Um, I think that the way this card fell out, I think that Monday and Tuesday are basically bridged together. So I kind of almost want to just put both of these cards up for the screen together. Um, Aquarius, not my favorite message to give. We have the Tower on Monday. We have the Three of Swords showing up on Tuesday. With these having a bridge card, this may be something that happens kind of all at the same time, but the energy from whatever this particular incident is lasts easily through Monday and Tuesday. So with the Tower card on Monday, what's going on is something that has made you feel secure and stable that you thought would last indefinitely has suddenly and unexpectedly been removed from your experience. Three of Swords is telling me whatever this is, it's taking you emotionally um, I feel really I feel emotionally blindsided here whenever I see Tuesday's card um, this is telling me that there is definitely heartache and sorrow about whatever this is that disappeared now our bridge card that came up came out sideways so I'm gonna read it sideways which is what I'm not quite sure about yet so we're gonna feel into that but we've got the four of wands that came out sideways now the four of wands when it's sideways has to do with home um, when it's right side up, it's somebody coming home or into the nest. When it's upside down, it's somebody leaving the home, but usually it's a temporary departure. They're going to be coming back. So, because this is sideways, whatever this is going on with this tower and the three of swords, whatever this is, I think that it's got people on the move. All right, it's got people in your sphere of influence on the move and possibly even yourself. And there could be a lot of going back and forth to home on Monday and Tuesday. Um, there could be a lot of people converging on home and a lot of people also exiting the home. There could be, um, there could be some kind of evacuation that's happening and there could be other people coming in to uh, kind of clean up the mess, like say maybe maybe your basement flooded, maybe the sump pump went out and the basement flooded and I don't know, you know, maybe there was just a lot of rain and a big storm and maybe the maybe a tree fell on the roof or something like that. And so then, you know, this would be, the, that would explain the tower card and the three of swords card, especially if you love your home. And then the bridging card of going back and forth to home. This may be you getting out of the home and contractors coming in to put it back together. You're getting out temporarily. They're only going to be there temporarily because this card is always a temporary. So, um, and this card to me does talk about either home or work, but someplace that feels like home. This is someplace where you are regularly. Okay. So there's definitely something going on on Monday or Tuesday that has to do with someplace where you are regularly, someplace that is close to your heart, that there is some kind of shakeup going on there. Um, long term with the tower is when the rebuild comes in, the rebuild is better than what was there before. So if you want to look at it like that's the silver lining, then that's the silver lining that I see there. Okay, so that's Monday and Tuesday Aquarius. Pretty dramatic start to the week. Wednesday, you guys have the Two of Wands showing up. And the Two of Wands just tells me that you do have some choices to make. Um, whatever these choices are that are showing up for you on Wednesday, there's really not a bad choice. Like you can't make a bad choice. What you have as far as options are all good. And so I think that, you know, basically it's just a matter of you can't do all the options. So you have to narrow it down to the ones that you can do. And that's what we see you doing Wednesday. 
Thursday we have a really, really, really good card, and I'm so happy to see this after Monday and Tuesday. You do have the Wheel of Fortune, and the Wheel of Fortune means that things are moving forward in a positive direction in a smooth way. So very happy to see that. That means, you know, you're getting, you're starting to feel like things are getting back on track by the time we get to Thursday. Friday. We have the Five of Swords. This is an argument, debate. Um, this could be, this kind of feels like you may be having an argument or debate with a company, maybe an insurance company or a government entity. Um, you know, this could be saying, you know, you really owe me da 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 because this happened and now I'm out of this or that or whatever. I'm out of a car or a house or whatever. And so, you know, you're maybe fighting with them about how much this company owes you, whether it's insurance, whether it's some kind of government agency, whatever. Um, but it does feel like this is, um, you know, this doesn't have to be with a company or a government agency because there's all kinds of levels that these cards come in with, but I'm getting that strongly, so I'm going to bring that up. Uh, for a lot of you, this is just going to be a fight among uh, colleagues or among friends that doesn't, you know, when we have the Five of Swords, this is not a fight that ends well, okay? Now, let's look at Saturday. Saturday is where you had your other bonus card come in. All right. So what we had coming up for Saturday is we had the moon in reverse, and we also had the six of wands in reverse. So moon in reverse, when we're looking at that, that's a truth that's coming out, something that you did not know that's coming out that changes your perception about a situation that you're involved in or you're connected to somehow. Six of wands in reverse, I really want to feel into this a little bit more. I think that there was a project that you were working on that not only benefited you, but also benefited other people as well. And as you were working on this project now, this new truth has come out, this truth that you, you didn't know about before. And I really feel like this has derailed this project or it has slowed it down incredibly. It's definitely been an obstacle to completing whatever this project is that benefits yourself and other people as well. And then on Sunday, you do have the King of Wands. What I'm hearing is this is a windfall. So for some of you, this is um, a larger amount of money than what you usually see coming to you at one time showing up on Sunday. So you have a very up and down week, a very dramatic up and down week. Aquarius, I haven't seen anybody else have a week like this, I don't think ever, as long as I've been making these videos. And that's been since, what, 2013, October of 2013. So very dramatic week. Um, and all I can do is wish the best for you as you go through here. Those of you who would like to get a private reading and investigate any of this more deeply, of course, I would be honored to be able to help you with that. Just get a hold of me on the contact information on the website at the bottom of the screen, and we'll get you taken care of quickly. Everybody have a fantastic week. Keep your chin up. Know that it's just one week. There will be more weeks after this, and I will see you guys the next time around. Peace out.